I'm the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga Copper Crescent of the Conga. Quite fascinating material coming out of here. Uh, we have a young dolomite matrix and in this particular section you have almost this dendritic formation of uh, 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 most likely heterogenite, making like little plants, like you'd, you'd see fossils. Maybe this, these are uh, uh, plants which eventually got replaced by heterogenite. Then you have a thin layer of what I suspect to be chrysocola. Sitting on top of that would be botroids of uh, waxy black botroids of heterogenite, which have been dusted by a layer of druzy quartz crystals. And sitting on that would be what I suspect is Vesigia right versus. Uh, versus malachite. Crystal form is more that of the Vesigiorite than it is of the malachite. Also not primary malachite. Also a little bit of a color variation. Now I've looked at some specimens with, with a little bit of this almost a bayildenite green color. Uh, but I can't see any any traces of, of uh, crystallization. So it's, it's as if the, the uh, uh, the quartzes are stained with this, this pale green, as you can see there. Um, going across like this. Also interesting is the preciation zone of this material. Runs lengthwise, very typical to the tanker deposits. And uh, yeah, aesthetically rather appealing. It's just, yeah, I think it, it will not stand flat. It will topple a bit on that angle, so you'd need a stand for this. So if you have it standing on the stand looking sideways at it, this, I'm giving you a good sideways view here because these, these dendrites are quite lovely. And then, of course, looking from the top down, you'd have this effect. This all the way from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the uh, Katanga Copper Crescent, formerly Shaba Zaire.